here driver mojo got an update for you look at this a sexy freightliner this is an amazon all electric e cascadia day cab semi truck that's pretty interesting got to park next to one of these today e cascadia now check out this how long this base is in the back this right here is where your battery pack is. Battery pack charging and charging uh, inverters. You've got uh, dual inlets here for uh, CSS and they've got uh, two chargers here so I imagine you can uh, plug two of those at a time in there for the, your 400 watt, 400 volt architecture and you've got all your error messages and such there. Very cool. And we go back here. Um, now, I was wondering if they had hub motors or if they're using uh, something like Allison Transmission has a hub or a motor transmission. And this one here, I see two of the motor transmissions in there. This right here, that right there is your motor transmission to these back wheels. And then you have another one right there for the other set of wheels. Orange cables indicate high power, high voltage. So you see a lot of that run throughout. Uh, the fact that the battery is uh, low, heavy, heavy and low, makes these things a little less um, uh, less likely to uh, for jackknifing because jackknifing happens when you, the weight of your trailer pushes, pushes your trailer or pushes your tractor. And uh, so th 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 it reduces the risk of that having a heavy base on your tractor is actually a really good thing. You got a couple of these here. These look brand new. And I would love to take one of these for a test drive. I bet they got some really smooth, quiet pickup. Oh uh, yeah, one day I'll get to, till then I thought I'd share the 100% electric Amazon semi-trucks.